Sit down. I didn't call you. I didn't call you. Michael Cohen recently said you called black voters stupid. That's false. Omarosa has accused you of using the N-word, and the, rap- the rapper Little John has said you called him Uncle Tom. What's your response? I, I don't know who Little John is. I don't, I he really was don't. on The Apprentice. I don't know. Oh, he was? Okay. Yeah. Oh, I see. Have you ever- CNN should be ashamed of itself having you working for them. You are a rude terrible person. You shouldn't be working for CNN. In Jim's defense, I've traveled with him and watched him. He's a diligent reporter who busts his Well, I'm not a big fan of of yours either, so I understand. to be honest. On the campaign trail, you called yourself a nationalist. Some people saw that as emboldening white nationalists. Now people are also saying that the president... I don't know why you'd say that. That's such a racist question. There are some people that say that now the Republican Party is seen as supporting white nationalists because of your rhetoric. What do you make of that? I don't believe it. That's such a racist question. Honestly, I mean, I know you have it written down and you're going to tell me. Let me tell you, it's a racist question. The question Thank you very is, much. Why sit, are you? Sit down. Please. But the question. I, I think I am a great moral leader and I love our country. Take a look at the CNN polls, how inaccurate they were. That's called voter suppression. How are you going to push forward your pro-life agenda? Just going to push. I've been pushing. Uh, President Erdogan said he's not going to follow your sanctions and he's going to keep uh, buying uh, oil from. Uh, Who said that? Uh, President Erdo- Erdogan. Turkey. I know, I know. And you're gonna meet him uh, soon. Just can't understand his. Okay. Do you impeach somebody because he created the greatest economic uh, success in the history of our country? Let's impeach him because the country is so successful. Let's impeach him. The election's over. The election's over. Now everybody is in love. President Obama allowed a very large part of Ukraine to be taken, and right now you have submarines off that particular parcel that we're talking about. You that know was, what I'm talking that was about. President Putin who, who annexed Crimea. Sir. That was President Obama's regime. If Let's you don't go. mind, Let's Mr. Go. President, Come on. that this... Such a hostile media. It's so sad. You ask me about... No, you rudely interrupted him. See, when you talk about division, it's people like this that cause division. Great division. I would love to have a very even, uh, modest, boring tone. I would be very honored by that. But you know what? When you have to fight, all the time fight, because you're being misrepresented by the media, you really can't do that. But, Where are you from, please? Japan. Okay. Say, hello. Say hello to Shinzo. Yes. I'm sure he's happy about tariffs on his cars. Go ahead. If it's unfair to the country and it's costing millions of dollars, why don't you just Give him the mic, it? please. I've answered the question.